Yeah, this is just gonna suck. No two ways about that. Three, two, one, go, I guess. That could have been bad. <laughs> Blow up our own guys with the uh, grenade launcher. Welcome to the next part of our Iron Man playthrough here on Door Kickers 2. If you missed the last video, it's definitely worth the watch. Um, I'll link it up in the top corner. But we did lose Garcia. That's our first killed in action on the playthrough so far. Nolan and Macaulay were also injured, so they cannot join us on this mission. Uh, but hopefully you guys are enjoying the series so far. If you are, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Uh, right now, only 13% of y'all are subscribed. So we're really trying to have the channel grow. I really appreciate the support so far. So it takes two seconds, hit the subscribe button, and then turn your notification bell on so you're notified when a new video comes out. Right now, we've been posting videos daily. So hopefully you guys are enjoying that. This mission is called Ambushed. Uh, we just need to eliminate all the terrorists. It says misplaced trust and treachery have landed one of our squads at the wrong end of an ambush. Surrounded and outgunned. Survive and eliminate all enemies. Survive. That's going to be the hardest part of an ambush always. Uh, because we're definitely going to be at a disadvantage. Our force has merged into a mixed force of allied militia. But their allegiance is currently unclear. There's probably going to be some bad guys shooting us in the back. As well as in the front from the ambush. Expect to be engaged from the lead and trail vehicles, but beware of the heavy machine guns dominating the checkpoint. Alright, so we're going to bring some assaulters and grenadiers. Everyone's kitted out with frags, uh, lots of frags, and some smoke grenades. More frags and smoke grenades. Um, if you aren't aware of how to react to an ambush, I'll put up the basic doctrine. Uh, you can pause the video and read through that real quick. But essentially what you need to do is anyone who's in the kill zone needs to get out. Uh, you need to cover your tracks with smoke if you can and return fire. I mean, that's pretty much all it comes down to it. So we'll go ahead and plop our guys down here. Uh, we should, I mean, realistically, as we pulled in here, we would have complete eyes on everything. Nothing would be unclear to us because we just drove in here. But anyway, we've got an allied militia back here. We can make contact with him to gain control. Turncoat Militia, hopefully he's going to shoot him real fast. We've obviously got a manned machine gun here, unmanned here, another manned machine gun, and another machine gun up here. We can't really tell if it's manned or not. So, yeah, this is just going to suck. No two ways about that. So, biggest priorities are going to be returning fire and getting out of the kill box. So, if you think about this right now, this machine gunner's got his gun pointed pretty much directly at Biggles here. So what we're going to do is we're going to have Biggles shoot back. We're also going to have Cobra shoot back. And we're going to get off the X. So we're going to immediately start moving. Um, we want to get these guys out of the kill box. So we're going to send them in opposite directions. So one of these two is going to be able to kill him pretty quick. Um, same thing here. Jones is going to have to shoot him. We're going to have Bremer shoot this guy. We're going to start to... We're going to need to move out of our ambush lane here. Jones will shoot at him. We'll also get him up into some cover. Pilgrim is going to need to shoot this direction. I don't actually think that he can see him. So we're going to drop a grenade over there. And we're going to have King work his way around to help out. So he can be looking this way. Then check out this corner and then see what he can see up here. So, this is going to suck. There's no two ways about that. Um, we'll get these guys who are closest to us killed first while these guys try and flank on this machine gunner. And we'll just have to see what happens. Uh, three, two, one, go, I guess. Alright, so we've got a few turncoat militia over here. Allied militia is shooting at them, so that's good. I think he's still in the process of throwing the grenade. These guys are moving out. Okay, Biggles is hurt. I think all of these guys are dead now. So they can turn. We need to take out that RPG as well as just anyone who's looking here. Uh, you can turn around and help shoot them. You continue to hold this. Alright. Grenade went off. Okay, this is cleared out. 
Let's get Biggles up here. Looks like Cobra's okay now also. Let's pull King down to here. Hold what we've got for a second. Okay. Worked out surprisingly well. Um, so Biggles is injured. Everyone else is doing okay. I'm going to say that north sector is cleared here. I'm not sure if more guys are going to come from this direction, so that kind of sucks. But we'll keep these guys here for a moment. Uh, I'm going to have King run down here and make contact Thank you. so that we can control him now. We'll get these guys up to here and start with some better angles. All right, so we are in relative safely, safety now. Um, I'm nervous about leaving anyone not up here. So I think what I'm gonna do is have Rimmer stay here. We'll go ahead and pull these guys down. Um, watch this direction. Move these guys across. And we'll just leave him here to watch them. Holding. All right, so. We've got some dead space behind the old school bus here. And then obviously we've got another machine gun up there. Don't know if it's armed or not yet, but we've got this space up here. So we're going to start prepping the area with frags. Let's get some frags into all of these spots. Make sure that none of them are going to send any Drag back towards us. We still, of course, don't throw frags with those lead guys because um, they're continuing to hold cover for us. Let's get another frag out here. We've got a good, good angle on him. We brought lots of frags, so you guys ambush us. We ambush back with frags. See if we can get one up here. Okay, got a couple more guys coming out. Let's see if we can get a 203 over here. Okay, that uh, hit, <laughs> hit Josie and Brimmer. Let's try that again. Maybe a little bit further. Uh, maybe he can't quite reach that. <laughs> That could have been bad. <laughs> Blow up our own guys with the grenade launcher. So I think what we're going to do now is we're going to smoke this area and we'll push past. We'll go ahead and get a bunch of smoke in here. Um, so we talked about this the other day in our uh, equipment video. Smokes are good. I think they're good in this game. Definitely. Uh, you just have to be careful with smokes, right? So we still don't know if there's someone on this machine gun or not. If I was on this machine gun and a bunch of smoke started getting thrown down in front of me, I'm just going to start shooting into the smoke. Smoke doesn't stop bullets. So we do need to be careful here as we move across. We're going to try and use this to conceal our movement a little bit. So we'll get some thick smoke going right there and we'll start to move these guys up. Um, We're going to pull them around a little bit. These guys to here. Bring these guys down as well. Start moving like that. Okay, this is fairly well cleared out. Obviously that smoke is going to clear. We're going to have him get a grenade back here. Um, and then he's going to need to move Holding. down to here. Hold an angle like that. And that's going to be the last guy did. So it looks like just Biggles was injured there. 
Um, we'll go ahead and rewatch this. Jeez, what's going on there? Okay, that's glitched out on the screen. But we'll go ahead and play this back. Sorry about this thing being stuck on the screen. But um, react to contact, right? Got to get out of the kill zone. So immediately, uh, we don't want to just stand here and try and return fire. We want to return fire while we're on the move and get out of the way. So again, we had these two um, flank sort of either side of the machine gun. He can only shoot at one of us. Uh, looks like he decided to shoot at Biggles. So Cobra is able to take him out as these guys move, move forward. Um, Biggles is getting shot in the back by this guy. Our allied militia is working on taking him out. Um, again, we're moving up and taking out threats as we see them. We got a grenade down on that machine gun. And now we've sort of broken contact. We've killed everyone in this area. So now all of this is ours. So we continue on. Now we go to make contact with our allied militiamen over here. While we still have these two holding a L on anyone who's coming out through here. So we start to move, consolidate our guys together and start raining frags out over here. We brought lots of frags. Uh, you guys ambushed us, so we're gonna throw lots of frags on top of y'all. So once our frags go off, um, we're gonna go ahead and after we try and kill our teammates with the 203, uh, we're gonna get some smoke out to cover our movement here. Again, just be wary of using smoke. Bullets go through smoke. So, as we move these guys around the side of the bus, that's pretty well cleared out. We get another frag out here, and that is that kills the last guy. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, like the video, put a comment down below on what you'd like to see next. If you're enjoying the series, keeping up with it, make sure you're subscribed. Again, only 13% of you guys are. Turn on that notification bell so you're notified when a next video comes out. And... Hopefully you're enjoying, I'm having fun making these, and we'll continue on in the next one.